What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another banger of a game, of a matchup. Tonight's matchup, we have Eclipse Astral versus Volition Obsidian. Okay, This is going to be the second match of the IGL season, so not too many stats to go off of. We can't really look back at the previous weeks, essentially, and look and see who the better team is because there's a lot of... Uh, um, different things that essentially happen in the stats week to week basis sometimes the stats don't get reported the teams report the stuff late um so essentially we can only go with the information that the teams provide for me so that being said we have i'm gonna start it off with the tail of the tape as i usually do let's hop over to the tail of the tape real quick as you guys can see right here we have the tail of the tape and we essentially i'm gonna start it off with a uh, volition obsidian essentially uh, team captain laser zombie him and I were talking in DMS a little bit beforehand uh, They've been together for about three months months. Uh, they average Around the range of d3 to c1. Uh, they don't have any girls on the team and essentially Been playing together for about three months um, They do have a couple social medias if you guys want to follow them You guys can go ahead and follow their social medias as they're new up-and-coming um, Esports organization trying to grow their brand trying to grow their members So if you guys are interested there goes the links for them inside the chat also laser zombie asked me to uh, plug his uh, Twitch of him and his starter uh, Wibs or Wibis I, my, my apologies Wibis GG on Twitch as well So if you guys want to go ahead and hit them with the follow you guys can go ahead and hit them with the follow There's the links right there as well, but the starting lineup like I said not many stats reported here uh, Volition Obsidian, essentially. The starting lineup is going to be Laser Zombie, Wibis, and I believe it's going to be... I want to say it's going to be Skeeter. I'm not 100% sure as to who it's going to be just yet because uh, he never got back to me on that one, but 100% sure it's going to be Laser Zombie and Wibis. So, hopping on over to the Eclipse Astral side, we're going to have the starting lineup with Chai, Eric, and Kipo underscore Rocket League, which for the future reference, we're just going to call him Kipo. And uh, talk to his team captain, or talk to the team captain, um, Achai, inside the in DMs and stuff like that before the game started. Um, essentially, they've been together for about a month as well. They're sitting around high C1, and basically they won last week's game 3-1. to one. So, with that being said... I believe we are waiting for the competitors to hop inside the arena as we are in this lovely, lovely stadium. You guys seen that with the flyby. You guys seen it from uh, the tail of the tape, essentially. But like I said before, Volition is 1-0 oh on the season with, with the win coming from last week, 3-1. to one. So that being said, welcome everybody into the lovely, lovely arena. I did send the password information over and we see Chai, Eric, and Kipo from Volition joining the arena right now we're just waiting for laser zombie and his crew to hop in the arena um 
What's up, High Drive? What's up, Giggles? I see you guys in the chat. A wannabe nerd. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream. Uh, we do have a wannabe nerds match coming up next. That's going to be a 2v2, I believe. Uh, it's going to be Comeback Esport is his team versus PMRLR Esports. So that his matchup is going to be next. So I appreciate you checking out the channel in advance. Um, that being said, that's going to be the second matchup of tonight. And then we have a third matchup, another 2v2 matchup, and that's going to be Bud McBays versus OG Seals. And we have casted OG Seals 17 million times on this channel before. They love us. They want to keep coming back. And we all know who they are. That's Morty and I believe Morpheus is his teammate's name. So I've always liked to see OG Seals on the channel. Uh, I believe last season it was a tough, tough loss in the finals. Uh, they had a, a run in the playoffs, but they ended up losing. Uh, in the finals, I believe so it's gonna be pretty interesting to see that matchup as well So if you guys like Rocket League you guys like the content go ahead and stick around for the remainder of the stream Because said we're gonna have three matchups tonight with this one being the first so That being said like I said waiting for laser zombie Waiting for laser zombie to join the matchup. He's asking me in DMs right now what the password was, even though I sent it to him. So my apologies on that one. <laughs> there he is in the chat right there too. King Hydra, what's up, man? Glad to see you, man. Much love to you. Here comes Laser Zombie right now with the rest of the crew, probably. <laughs> I tried. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate you guys. Yeah, so we got Skeeter, Laser Zombie, and Wibis all inside the arena. Everybody looks like they're good to go. So I want to set this off. We're going to go ahead and start this matchup. This is a best of five series, so everybody knows. Hopefully, all my stuff is correct. My apologies. I usually get this stuff done beforehand in the past, but I was literally unconscious most of the day today. Something hit me today, and I was not feeling well. So let's put that aside, and the show must go on, and let's start this matchup off as Chai's going to probably get an early kickoff goal, and he does. Chai starts this one off with a banger. Absolutely two seconds into this matchup. The 50-50 on the kickoff right there. You guys can see nine times out of ten that does work out for most teams. That's why a lot of teams are actually send that double commitment initially off of the uh, the kickoffs. It's a big-time demo coming out of Chai as well. So if they can follow up with another goal, but Skeeter's going to deny that one early. Once again, the starting lineup for... This Volition Obsidian team, we have Laser Zombie, Skeeter, and Wibis. They're taking on this tough Eclipse Astral team. That was just a little bit off target right there. Eclipse Astral coming in hot right off the kickoff. And I always say this, you guys probably hear this every stream, but usually in these IGL matchups, I usually typically have a goal scored within the first 10, 15 seconds. And that kind of sets the tone as to who's going to win that first game. Now, it doesn't set the series as that one's a little bit off target from Wibis. It doesn't set the series necessarily, but it does set the precedent as to what's going to happen with that first game. Nice aerial coming out of Kipo. Double commitment coming out of uh, uh, Volition. My apologies. A great defense being played by both sides. Both teams just kind of feeling each other out, trying to gain that field possession as well. This is going to be popped off the back wall. Nobody there. No, I, I regret saying that because Chai is going to be there for the follow-up hit. Nice pass off the back wall from Kipo. Kipo pops it right there. Wibbis just misses the touch and side flips to the right-hand side. And Chai is there for the nice, nice follow-up touch right there. Going to put Eclipse up 2-0. No problems whatsoever, guys. Thank you guys very much for checking out the stream. I appreciate it so very much. This one might find its way in. Laser Zombie's going to pop it over to the right-hand side. Chai off the top left. Skeeter is there with a close goal, though, because Kipo was there lurking. I'm not sure if that one's going to go through or not. I believe it was going to be 50-50 on the goal line. We'll love to see that one play out. As Kipo is going to pop this one over as well, and Skeeter's going to save that one, too. Absolutely crazy offense being played right now by Eclipse Astral. And Volition is in trouble. They need to have this transitional goal right here. Skeeter misses the aerial on that one. And Eric is going to have a chance at this one for the counterattack. 
And Laser Zombie meets him at midfield and kind of just pops that one backwards. Clips Astral trying to keep this ball on the orange side. Maybe add to that lead 3-0. to zero. Volition definitely needs to wake up a little bit and start to get some of these passes like this one right here to Chai. This one might find its way in just off target. Bottom left-hand corner. Definitely wants that one back. He picked up his hat trick in the first game. I see a lot of misses coming on the Volition side, though. So I think Eclipse just needs to clean things up and actually maintain car control or uh, uh, ball control, essentially, and, and just start taking some shots towards the net because I'm seeing a little bit of sloppy defense on the Volition defensive side. Either it be missed touches or just whiffs in general. This game is still anybody's ball game. Two minutes remaining in this game number one. Like I said before, anybody's ball game, minute and 48 seconds now. Laser Zombie doing everything he possibly can to keep this on the blue side. Get a pass to his teammates waiting in the wing. Skier pops it off the right-hand side. Nobody there. Wibbis could not get up in the air for that one. Eric beats everybody to that one. It's a good heads up play by Eric to kind of shut that offense down early as this one might get a nice little pass to keep Ochai follow, following through with it, but could it quite get the pass through? Volition still have yet to, I think, even put a shot towards the net. Most of the members on the Volition side have been basically playing defense and keep away. Trying to get this ball cleared. This one might have a chance. Laser Zombie puts it down the middle. Keeple's going to clear it with ease. One minute remaining. And like I said, kind of shutting down the offense before they even get a chance to even do anything. Just to see the team captain here. Laser Zombie for the Volition side. Only has 84 points in this game. That just goes to show you how tough this Eclipse Astral team really is. like to point out that we do have um, Chai does have a Twitter. I forgot to shout out his Twitter, so my apologies to that one. Chai, the uh, team captain of the Volition team, does have a Twitter account. If you guys want to follow him on Twitter, there's his Twitter in the chat right there. It's the guy right here that has two goals, essentially putting the team on his back in a goal early, first two seconds. And this one's going to come to a close with Eclipse Astro taking game number one. We're going to see if we can get a zero second goal that's going to hit the ground. Like I said, Eclipse Astro taking that game number one early goal within the first two seconds of the game. Chai setting the temple early, basically having that momentum and keeping it. Absolutely beautiful performance from that Eclipse Astral team. Just basically maintaining that car control the whole entire time and set the precedent pretty early. Like I said, with that early two-second goal, then essentially Chai leading up to that nice follow-up hit for that second goal as well. And basically after that, it was just they were just playing against the clock at that point. But like I said, a little bit of sloppy defense. I do see a lot of openings on the Eclipse Astral side, so Volition needs to definitely take advantage of that. They need to have some more transitional type offense and a lot more plays, uh, passing and stuff like that coming through. Once they start getting that stuff down, I really believe that this is going to be anybody's ball game. I can't really pick one side or the other, but Eclipse Astral definitely coming out and putting the exclamation point on this first game number one. So I'm going to go ahead and give them their win. I forgot to do that, so my apologies to them, but... Let's hop into game number two and see if we can uh, maintain this momentum for Eclipse Astral. Hope you guys are enjoying the show. Eric can try to start this one off early for Eclipse. And this one, I was going to say, might actually result in an early goal. But Skeeter there for the stop and to shut down that offense once again. We see a lot of members right there. Laser Zombie doing a very good job keeping this possession there. But I was going to say, we see a lot of members of the Volition side just not even moving past midfield. Laser Zombie was the only person that was past midfield. Everybody else, like Skeeter and Wibis, were definitely back more, um, at least at midfield or behind it. 
They need to be up on that for the attack, like I said before. And this is a double commitment coming out of Volition and a miss and a whiff from the goalkeeper. So Chai's gonna go ahead and get himself his third goal of the series. Wibis couldn't handle that one. A little bit too much, a little bit too much heat on that one. Because he was the last person back for this Volition Obsidian team. Here comes Laser Zombie. That one might be a pinch towards the net. It is, and Wibis is gonna save that one. Chai with the fake, I believe. And this is gonna be a chance right here for Laser Zombie. Can he put this one in? It pops up over the head. Pops up over right over that it looked like it was gonna waterfall down as laser's gonna go ahead and get that save right there that's a good touch right there by laser eric is taking his time doesn't really have too much boost didn't get the jump off the sidewall that he wanted either missed opportunity on the offensive set offensive side of things for volition Zombie definitely wants that one back. Another double commitment coming out of Volition. We have Laser Zombie and Wibis both fighting over the ball there. 50 50 is going to go to Chai on this one. Looks like he has two members. As you guys can see right there, Hippo coming up on that one, doing a great job. And now this one right here, Chai is going to rotate back. And as you see, Eric is going to go ahead and take advantage of this. Nobody back for Volition once again. But this is the rotation errors I'm talking about. And this is what uh, Volition, I mean, uh, essentially, yeah, Volition needs to do. The Eclipse is doing very, very well. They're essentially cheating up past midfield and waiting for the opportunities to present themselves to them. And that's been the difference maker so far in this game, essentially, is Eclipse just taking advantage of the misplays and the miscues from this Volition Obsidian team. And Volition has not been coming up on those ones. As you can see right here, they're kind of cheating up. But Skeeter is definitely going back for boost, it seemed like. He was going back for that boost. Try trying to get Chai trying to get a little touch on the back or bottom end of, the end of his car. Put a soft little touch for a pass there. This one's gonna pop over to Eric. It's gonna go all the way black back to the blue side. Might be an opportunity for Volition to get their first goal of the series. Has yet to happen. They've yet to get their first goal. Laser Zombies is a little bit off target on that one. And this is where Wibis needs to be up in the air, challenging that one to keep that possession on their side of the field. This is a nice pass right here. Skeeter and Laser Zombie both up for this pass attempt. Laser just didn't have the angle that he wanted. Skeeter's going to see if he can do something here. This one's going to pop off the back wall. Anybody there? I was going to say, anybody there on the back side, but it looks like Laser's going to put this one down the middle, and Kipo's going to save it and deny them their first goal of the series. Skeeter doing a great job rotating back. Touch off the back wall now. Eric trying to put that one through with the follow-up shot and the pass from Chai. Couldn't quite get it going, though. Definitely an interesting series presenting itself in front of us. Like I said, just not a lot of opportunities happening that one it looked like it was going to be an own goal there for a second from skeeter but playing it very very well just popping it over to the right hand side nice little pop pass over the middle eric in great position waiting for that one pops it right back to the corner only one person back for this volition team laser zombie doing a good job slowing that one down but then here comes the trouble right here i was gonna say skeeter has no boost I'm not sure if this one's going to be a shot attempt or not. I don't think they have the angle or the or the uh, the pass for that one, and I was correct in saying that. But Chai doing a good job right there, following up, and this is the, what I'm talking about right here: maintaining this possession on their side. And essentially, something's going to open up eventually for this Volition team. I mean, uh, for this Eclipse team, because Volition's just getting boost starved. Skeeter has a chance at this one. Nice little air dribble, trying to 50-50 this one into the net potentially. Forty seconds and a dream left for Volition in this game number two. Skeeter off the back wall, nice little pass to Wibis. Wibis could not finish it though. A little bit too far to the outside with that one. Trying to put a soft touch on the bottom carriage of his car once again. Now this Eclipse team is forced to play a little bit of defense. Chai has no boost, gonna let that one bounce down, which is a great play in my personal opinion. 
Uh, you don't always have to touch everything that comes to your side because if, essentially if you touch that ball, the angle that you're coming on, this one's going to be a goal from Kipo. Nice pass from Eric off the right-hand side. And this would have never happened. This would have never happened if Chai would have touched that ball. That ball would have basically went right back in front of their net. And essentially when that happens, you're leaving your teammates, the two defenders there, in a pretty bad situation because, number one, they weren't expecting you to touch that ball. And number two, the defense is going to creep up on that one and potentially get a dunk. So that's a very good heads-up play on Chai's part to not touch that ball and essentially let his teammates kind of figure that one out. And Chai's going to take one for the road and get his second goal of the game. And put Eclipse Astral again in the W, 4-0 to zero on this one. And they're one win away of sealing the deal and getting this series. Absolutely crazy, crazy game right there for Eclipse Astral. Definitely turns it up towards the end there to try to basically maintain that momentum in this game number two. Just absolutely dominating performance coming out of Eclipse. Chai with two goals, Kipo with one goal, and Eric with one goal as well. Once again, the lack of shots on target, the lack of uh, um, the opportunities, I should say, for this Volition team has not really presented itself. Very good defense playing that time. They cleaned up a lot, Eclipse did, uh, on the defensive side of things, but there's still opportunities that they left out there, like that one transitional goal that Laser had but it basically the ball just ramped up on the side or on the bottom part of the wall. And he wasn't expecting that and didn't have enough boosts to counteract that. Interestingly enough, like I said, Volition still has not scored their first goal yet. Eclipse has just been all over the field. I basically think that they have a, like seven goals already at this point in the game. So let's hop into this game number three and see if Volition can stay alive and maybe pull off the inevitable, the reverse sweep. See if these guys can do it. I think that there was a little miscommunication there on the field. I think the wrong people joined the wrong sides of the team. Something like that happened out. But Eric is going to have a nice little shot attempt right here. Nice dunk play by Eric. And there's a follow-up shot right there from Kipo. Eight seconds into this game. Wibis right here gets a gets dunked on off the top crossbar. My goodness, what a play that was. Like I said, we do have these early goals in this IGL. You guys are gonna hear me say it one more time. At least in this series, you're gonna hear me say it one more time. Because it happens quite often, like I said before. You see a lot of these early goals, and like I said, they set the precedent really, really early. Doesn't necessarily mean that that team's gonna win by any means, but. It definitely uh, puts a staple into what they're going to be about. I've seen it before. I've seen the first the, the team that scored the first goal essentially lose every single time. I had a series like that a couple games back. It was really interesting. This one's a bump right here from Kipo. Doing a good job shutting down Skeeter's attack early. Try not to give Volition any chance whatsoever. And it looks like Laser and Skeeter are both fighting over the ball there. Laser needs to have a follow-up touch on this one. Eric's going to pop it. I have no idea where Wibis is. Playing a little bit too far back. This is what I'm talking about right here. Doing a good job playing some shadow defense against uh, Chai. But he needs to be a little bit further up on those attacks. Like I said before, he's playing a little bit too far back. This is going to be popped off the back wall. Chance right here once again for Eclipse to try to score it. And Kipo. It's going to miss it. It's going to force Eric a little bit back. Chai going to try to get a nice little pass over to the middle for his teammates. Doesn't have enough boost to do that, though. It's going to be popped up. Eric has a chance at this. Can he get it? He does. He shoots a shot on target, but Laser is going to be there to save that. Time for Velissa to try to score something here, try to get something going. Eric has a chance right here. Nice little air dribble pass to his teammates. He backs off of that one. Child was trying to meet him in the air for that one. Getting a nice little banger of a hit, but couldn't quite read it the way he wanted to. Here comes Skeeter off the sidewall. Eric's going to beat him there first. Laser's going to do a nice job popping that one off to the right-hand side, or left-hand side. My apologies. Three minutes remaining in this game number three. Eclipse up 1-0. to zero. The Volition fighting to stay alive as this one might upper 90 in, and it does. Off the top crossbar, the right crossbar as well. It's going to be another goal for Eric. 
laps. This routine shot, essentially, 21 miles per hour. More importantly, it's going to put Eclipse up 2-0. to zero, As you have a nice little fake kickoff, delayed kickoff. All calculated and planned out. Chai puts a nice little shot on target from deep. Let's see if Kipo and Eric can try to follow up with these ones right here. These challenges right now from Eclipse are absolutely clean. Like I said, very minimal mistakes I'm seeing on the offensive side of things for Eclipse, other than the fact that they're not really... Um, some of the plays, they're not really getting the uh, the angles that they want, but still, the, the things that they're doing, like the 50-50 challenges that they're trying to go for, they're 100% of the time winning those. And the, the challenges that they're doing early as well, they're winning those too. So Shot attempt, upper 90 right there from Zombie as well. Almost snuck its way through, but just a tad bit off target. A whiff from Chai and also a whiff from, uh, I think that was Eric that we were on board with. Both of those guys essentially missed the ball. That one could have snuck its way through. Skeeter missing the ball right here. Kipo, a little bit of bait. Minute 45 seconds remaining in this game. Felicia needs to put the pedal to the metal here and go a little bit of a sicko mode and Score a couple of goals here to keep them keep their dreams alive. Nice little pass from Eric to Chai. Wasn't expecting it on the middle of the field, though. This one right here might be a 50-50. Eric trying to bait the defense into that one. Here comes Chai. Off the back left-hand side. Does he have the double touch? He does have a touch, but not on target. Keep will let him try to basically get himself a little highlight right there. This one might be a highlight as well. He has another double touch opportunity. Balled up very, very well. Skeeter with a nice save, though. Fifty seconds remaining. Trying to see if they can get one more goal before this game is over. Eclipses. It's been all Eclipse this whole entire series, just dominating out here. Well, listen, just didn't have uh, the offense to kind of keep up with these guys. This one might be a potential goal here. Laser Zombie pops in. Nice little pass from him, but couldn't quite get enough on that one. Skeeter's going to pop it off the back wall. Eric is going to go ahead and bite on that one. 20 seconds remaining. And this one might be another goal here for Eclipse. Chai just barely touches that one, trying to do the most with it. Puts a shot on target. Nice car control and ball control coming out of Chai. The final seconds of this game. And this one is all said and done. Eclipse Astral gets it done in three, ladies and gentlemen. And they're going to go ahead and pick up the sweep on this Volition Obsidian team. Absolutely dominating performance coming out of Eclipse Astral. That was absolutely amazing to see some of that car control, some of the ball control as well, man. It was really, really cool. Just not a lot of opportunities presented themselves for that Volition team. Like I said, they kind of uh, went flat early on in the game number one. Game number two was just they absolutely popped off as uh, Eclipse Astral did. Uh, got two goals late game, but they, they basically ma maintained and, and held a two-goal lead every single game that these guys had, the three games that they had. I think it was 2-0 the first game, 4-0 the second game, and it was actually 2-0 uh, this last third and final game. So, Volison, like I said, just not a lot of opportunities presented themselves, but nothing to hang their heads on. Essentially, go back, watch this gameplay, watch this film, and try to see where you guys can improve on. Like I said, I think a lot of that has to do with just your positioning on the field. You have one person going for the pass, and then that second person's going for the commitment as well. But you need that first person to kind of rotate back around. So Laser Zombie essentially needs to rotate back around, whereas Wibbis could kind of come up where Wibbis is really playing more defense, uh, trying to prevent like a, a transitional goal. When really he should be up trying to score that, that goal because Laser Zombie should be trying to hustle back and play defense essentially, meeting each other at midfield and exchanging on the uh, offensive and defensive side. So nothing to hang your guys' head over. That was a very, very tough Eclipse Astral team. GG's to everybody out there. Like I said, treat this as a learning, a teaching, ex ex uh, teaching moment essentially, okay?
So we have another matchup coming up. Like I said to you guys beforehand, a 2v2 comeback esports versus PMRL. RLR. <laughs> it's a very, very tough. I'm not even sure what the acronym actually even stands for. Literally, their name just says PMRLR Esports. So, GG's to both sides. I appreciate you guys very, very much for having me. Appreciate you guys having me cast. If you guys need me in the future, you guys know where to find me. IGL. I'm going to have a panel down below underneath the stream in the future. If you guys want to request me for any sort of special matches or anything like that, let me know. Uh, yeah. So, we're going to hop over to this next game. I'm going to get things prepped on my side. You guys can chill, hang out, listen to some music. And we should be go good to go in about 10, 15 minutes. I'm going to talk to both team captains and get the backstories on them as well, okay? Thank you guys very much. Laser Zombie, thank you very much for the 20 biddies, man. I appreciate you so very much. I don't know why my alert didn't work. The sound didn't work, work for that one, but I see them. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate you guys. GG's, like I said. I'll see you guys in a little bit.